how you can add a date picker on Shopify product page. If you want to give a specific date option for your products or anything else, then this video is for you. Plus, there are advanced settings if you only want to give a date for a certain period, like just for the next 30 days from today or any uh, specific date. So let's dive in. Uh, let's first have a look at the product. So we have this product and we have a date picker over here. We can just click on this icon and choose a date and this date will automatically be uh, selected and the customer can then check out and this information uh, will be given to us uh, after the, the order is completed. So I'll show you how to uh, set this up. First install the live product options app from Shopify app store. The link is in the description and let's uh, uh, move ahead to the Shopify panel, admin panel. Then go to apps and click on live product options. Once you have completed the onboarding process, you will land on the home page. I have already adjusted the settings, but if you are new, click on new product option to start. But I'll show you the settings over here. Okay, so in product targeting, you have two choices, single product or multiple product. Uh, then we'll go to, after selecting the products, we'll go to the product options. Uh, click on add options. And in the type section, go to date. Now we have a whole lot of uh, product options over here from text, multi-line, uh, drop-down list, image swatches, color swatches, uh, radio button, dimensions, upload if you want to upload a file, or a straightaway HTML tag. Okay, so this one is very simple. You just need to click on date for the type and change the name and label. So here is the label. You can easily choose the date format and this is the minimum and maximum date. So suppose I just want to give a 10 days specific, uh, only for the 10 days from 24 is the minimum and 30 is the maximum. So the date will only show from 24 to 31. So let's make it from 20, uh, 22 to November 30. So I can show you the other settings. Uh, let's so this is uh, here, this is it for the configuration. Let's go to advanced settings. So this is a very interesting setting over here in the information You can just type in the information and the icon will appear over here Simply over here In this help text will appear down over here And this is the maximum uh, minimum and the maximum days. So suppose uh, You want to give a gap of three to four days from the start. You can just click two and the maximum uh, from today uh, should be uh, 10 to 20 days. Let's take it 20. So the option will only appear uh, two days from now. So suppose the customer is uh, purchasing on 24th, they will, uh, the date available will be uh, after 24 and 25, which is 26. So they can choose from 26, two days from now. So this is exactly what's happening over here. Minimum days two. So from, uh, from after two days, the customer can select the date and the maximum is 10. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And the 10 days. So the maximum they can go is up to 10 days. So these are the pretty uh, easy settings. And if you want to change the look of the date picker, you can just go to CSS and drop your codes. Or the, if you want to do some other uh, other design settings, you can just hop here and do the design settings. And after doing the settings, just click save and enable. So the date picker, uh, for your product is done. I have used the live product options app So check out live product options on Shopify app store link is in the description It offers real-time custom product reviews for your online store super easy to install and great for personalized items It's a game changer for any e-com site and if you have any uh, questions for me, let me know in the comments and see you in the next video